Hey, what's going on everybody? James Dieter is back with a special video. I bought the Robot Chomp off of 7 bucks a pop during their uh, week of Black Friday deals. And it came in the mail uh, last week. And I haven't done a video on it. So I figured today would be a good day to show it off. Because it is a super, super awesome uh, vinyl figure and here is the top of the box and here is the size I already halfway undid it because it is super hard to uh, to take off it says chomp series 3 oh on the bottom it has the rest of them oh yeah there's the Statue of Liberty the I Love New York one, and I don't know what that one is in the purple. Oh, it looks like a sunset. Oh, that's cool. Wow. So let me get this, let me get this guy out and show you what he looks like. Super, super cool. Here is how it is packaged with foam. And then you take the foam out. And, oh, there's a little, there's a little booklet to show you how to, uh, there's a plastic piece that's covering his robot robot half that you you can take off to reveal it even better. So it comes wrapped in a bag. And here he is. Ah, uh, dude, that is sick. I've seen uh, the Gaslecast showed him off on their channel um, sometime in November. Oh, yeah, that's right. He's got a little plug-in. <laughs> that's cool. So let me take this plastic part off. Oh, there it goes. And there is a more detailed version. That is so cool. Oh, it's got a little little gauge there. His heart has stuff on it. There's gadgets and all kinds of stuff. That is so cool. Wow. Probably one of my favorite chomps that I have seen them make. I had the ketchup chomp at one point, but I, um, I think I donated it. I donated it to um, Dave's charity that he was supporting, uh, Puzzle Pieces Squared, um, a couple years ago, to raise money for an amazing charity that helps out um, autistic kids. But yeah, I like this one ten times more than that one. Super super cool. I don't know how they came up with this, but it is really, really awesome. Oh, it's got uh, Abominable Toys 2021 on the bottom of the foot. Yeah, Abominable Toys. Abom yeah, hard word to say. But yeah, since it's Christmas time, he's kind of uh, he's kind of like a Christmas type uh, figure since um, Abominable Snowmen are usually in cold climates and it's winter time, so. And it might actually snow um, in the next few days, so um, I will be off Wednesday and Thursday, so if it does snow, I will uh, probably go outside and enjoy it. But yeah, here is the, I think they call it the Robot Chomp. And I'll pick up the piece that, pick up the piece that came off, and it just goes back on. You just click it back on, and... Like that, and is back on. Yeah, there you go. But you can still. Oh, there you go. You can kind of. There, you can actually see the outline of the sn abominable snowman face right there. That is so cool. I love this figure. So uh, another awesome job by Abominable Toys, and their chomps. I need to get one of those. Um, what are they called? Chompers. The teeny tiny ones to go along with this guy. I don't think they make a, a version of uh, the robot one, but I need to get the one that looks like the blue and white one to go along with this guy. Because these are really, really cool figures. And they can come up with a ton of different designs to uh, make them look like. So can't wait to see what they come up with next. I love the um, the pirate one that they did too, because it's got a pig leg, it's got the He's got a hook hand, and I think he's got a parrot on his shoulder, I think. I might actually pick that one up if I find a good deal for it. I know uh, 7 Bucks a Pop is having another another uh, deal, but it's their uh, 
Christmas Christmas deals coming up. Um, I think they start Wednesday until uh, Christmas, so I'll be on the lookout for that. Because that guy, I got a ton of money off, because those are normally uh, 200 150 to $200 uh, figures, I think. I forgot how much I actually paid for it, but... There was the, I actually was going to buy the pirate one too because they had that one for sale along with that one and the ones I showed you on the back but I did not get those because I actually, well I still have room on the a few of my cubby holes I actually rearranged stuff but I never took a picture I have my handmade by robots on um, four shelves I have my ghastlies on one shelf I have my tiny ghosts on another shelf and now I have my chomp on its own shelf. So yeah, I'm sort of getting out of the Funko, collecting Funko for the time being. I was actually going to buy the Luffy on the Going Merry because I started watching One Piece again last week. I think I'm on episode 160. Yes, I'm only on 160 and there's over, I think, 1100 episodes now. So if I watched them from now until next year, I still will not be able to finish them. But yeah, I found a good deal for that on eBay last night, but I did not pull the trigger because I might actually go look for a car um, in the next couple days. Uh, see if my mom works or not because we are still sharing a car. Because I work from 11 at night to 7 in the morning, and then she usually doesn't work till, well, she started at uh, 8.30, and then... Uh, sometimes she works three times a week, sometimes she only works one. But uh, yeah, it works out perfect. So um, yeah, I need to get my own car so um, I feel free again. So so I can... I want to visit some of my good friends next year, but um, I've never been out of the state by myself. I've been to Florida with my dad um, probably five years ago. And when I was a kid, I was went to Florida. And, uh, yeah, that's as far as I've been. I would definitely love to meet Caitlin, Megan, uh, Jazzy, uh, Lori, Last Ketchum. That would be really, really awesome to just hang out with them for a day or two. To, uh, see their collections in person. But, yeah, I just, uh, hope everyone is having a good holiday season. Like I said in my last video, we finally got a tree and it is decorated. And, yeah, we are getting ready to, uh, for Christmas Eve, because we usually celebrate Christmas on Christmas Eve. So, we usually watch, um, Christmas Vacation all day long and eat some good food. So, I am looking forward to that. So, I love you all. Thank you so, so much for watching my videos. I really, really appreciate it. I have gained so many new subscribers for some reason. I don't know if it's... I don't know if it was because of the swap or just random people finding my channel, but I'm up to almost 650 subscribers. And a couple of months ago, I was only at like 634 or something. So that's that's really, really cool. I just hope everybody stays. And um, I don't know how people lose subscribers, but um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. And I'm getting close to... Uh, what is it, 35,000 um, views on my channel. I think I'm only 1,200 away, or a little over 1,200 away from uh, 35,000 views, which is really, really awesome too, since I do not make a video every single day like um, the Gasselcast does. I'm going to try to make videos once every day, because I still have like five things to show off. And uh, yeah, I want to hit the 35,000 view mark before the end of the year which there's still plenty of days left so that is my goal to um to end the year so that will be it for this video so thank you all for watching and until next time this is james Dieter telling you to have an awesome 